It's Erin Condren Life Planner 2024-2025 launch season, and I am so excited to share these items with you. If you are new here, welcome. I'm Tina, and if you are returning, welcome back. I want to first start off by thanking the Erin Condren team for sending me this collab box to share with you. This year's collections include Evolve, a colorful use of color to celebrate the movement of life with all its perfectly imperfect moments, made in collaboration with Etta B. Bold Blooms, a reminder to embrace your personal growth and bloom into the best version of yourself. And Canvas, stylishly designed to be understated for functional planning while also being a perfect blank slate for adding your personal touch like stickers. EC Insider launch is April 15th. The general launch is April 16th. If you are new to Erin Condren, becoming an EC Insider is free and allows you early access to shop big launches like this one. Plus you earn rewards points to use towards future purchases. Shopping on April 15th, you would receive an EC Insider exclusive gift with purchase, sticky notes with holder with any life planner purchase. I will include a link below for you to sign up to become an EC Insider if you are interested. There is also a gift with purchase available for a limited time life planner sampler set. I am so excited about this and I will be sharing those details with you in just a little bit. All of the 7x9 layouts are back but with new add-on options and a new sunrise coil. The compact vertical layout that was previously available only in the A5 size is now available in a seven by nine. That is so exciting. I know many of you have been wanting that. Plus an exciting daily duo life planner refresh that I have to share with you. I just love how our feedback has been heard and I'm so excited about all of the changes. I was given the option to choose what collection I wanted to get. I chose Canvas Design in the Daily Duo. And with that, I was sent coordinating accessories plus some other items from the Evolve collection and more. All right, here it is, the Daily Duo in Canvas. Now there are two planners here, but they are split. You get six months in one and six months in the other, hence the name, The Daily Duo. I did get the same cover for each one here. Um, it's really pretty and soft. Now, I believe that it's going to come in different soft colors, like neutral colors, similar to the canvas that was released um, last year. And if you're not familiar with Erin Condren covers, you can add a personalization, which I just chose to have my name put on there, which is actually really small because I just chose to put my first name. Honestly, I didn't really know what I wanted to put on here. I generally don't do personalization on my covers. On occasion, I will, but usually I don't. But I do like that you have the option to do that. The covers are also interchangeable so they come out very easily and you can replace them with another cover and then they pop right back in there are new covers that they are bringing us for this release including new vegan leather interchangeable colors as well those are so beautiful the coil that i chose was the rose gold coil the new coil color in Sunrise is not available to get in the Daily Duo. So if you are interested in that new coil, unfortunately that one you can't get with the Daily Duo. But I really like the rose gold, so I chose to get that. Um, when you order a life planner, you do get a little welcome pack here. It has a coupon for additional purchases as well as some little like journaling cards. There's three of them in here. Now with the life planners, you do get a ruler. This one, they have included a stencil in here. So that is really cool. I really like that. I like that we can see this very clearly, the measurements on here. I, however, wish it were longer. They made it this way because it will also fit in the A5 size planners. I think that they made that change last year where they were going to just have like a universal ruler, um, but now they've included this stencil design and I love it. It's super cool. I really, really like that. 
We're going to look at the beginning one, which is July through December of 2024. And then this one is the second half, which starts January through uh, June. On the inside, um, they did not make any changes here, but if you are new, um, it's kind of like a dashboard inside cover here where you have like a heading, an area to write a list in, a blank space, and then another blank space. Now I'm not seeing a barcode here, which is so nice. And I'm curious to see if it's on this one. That's the one thing I didn't notice. No barcode. That's nice. I wonder if it's on the back cover. I'm going to look now because I'm just kind of curious about that there's no barcode now I don't know if that just happens to be um, on this one here uh, but that was definitely something that I know that I did not like having the barcode right there all of them have this vellum in here which I generally like the vellum I think it's a really pretty touch to it this one has a tiny little asterisk like all over the page here now I don't know if that is my favorite design for these um the bottom page under here is like the this is my life so you could write your name on here um, it does say what the planner is daily life planner and generally i like to decorate that so i don't know how i will like that with this new vellum but it's really not that big of a deal honestly uh, to me, that's not a problem. I don't really focus that much on that. All right, let's go ahead and dive in here. Uh, these pages uh, look a little bit different than your regular life planner because the year is split. So these goal pages are just, there's six boxes here. There are these little asterisks in here. I honestly prefer it to be completely blank, but it's really not that big of a deal. Um, that is because this is the canvas it's super plain super neutral so by adding in the, the asterisks they're adding obviously a little bit of design element in there so it says a little progress each day adds up to big results and then there is an overview of july through december and then we've got a note section down here all right, we've got a tab 2024, and then there is also on this side the full um, 2025 glance here. So if you want to do pre-planning, now we're going into the actual planner. There have been changes made to this design. I so excited about them. So let's go ahead and look at the changes, and then I'll flip through and show you the tabs. So here's July, super, super simple, embrace all that is you. So we've got just the month here and then a little quote there. And we're keeping it, again, super simple, but I love it. We've got some pre-printed holidays in here. The sidebar over here is lined. And let's go in to the first change. I'm so excited about this. The monthly dashboard used to be on this side, but now it's over here. I love that. Oh my gosh, I love that. And I'm going to tell you why as we keep flipping through here. All right, so we've got a blank section here with tiny little asterisks, super simple. I love that. Um, we've got this section here with the bullet points. There is a line section here and then a dot grid. I love these boxes and I love that they're over here. Now we have the notes page, which is on this side. I love that. Okay, let's flip because there's more changes and look at what we have. Oh my gosh, we have another notes page and a weekly overview. This is completely new to the Daily Duo for this year. Um, it is not dated and it's got here like a horizontal layout on one page. We've got Monday through Sunday. It's got lines in here and it also has a section here for lists on this side. So we've got our little light gray bullet points in there. I love it and I love the font. All right, let's keep going. Let's move in and look, look at what is not here. And that is the monthly calendar is gone. Oh my gosh. I was so excited when I opened this up because 
that monthly calendar on every like page. Oh, I couldn't take it anymore. <laughs> Honestly, like I, I didn't like it. Um, just covered it up like every single week. So, oh my goodness, this is awesome. I'm going to save a lot of white out. I'm just saying, um, but I love it. So we've got here a Monday start. We've got 6 a.m. Um, through 7 p.m. There is a little dotted line in between the hour for the half hour mark. Love that. And then there is an extra box here at the bottom. And then we don't have a blank section here because before we had a calendar and a little blank box, but now we have this to do area and this nice big open space. The asterisk is smaller. I like that. I am so super excited about this planner. Uh, if you have been following me for a little while, then you might know that I was using a daily duo, but in an A5 size. So I really wanted to go and get the seven by nine and I had to pick this for my collab box and I'm so happy that I did because this is gorgeous. All right, let's keep going here. We've got Monday, uh, Tuesday and Wednesday, Thursday, and then Friday, Saturday. And Sunday and I really like the way that they designed that the with a larger number and a smaller day that's really pretty and then we end the week and we have a notes page here and a notes page there I love that and then we have the week overview I'm so excited about this this is going to be such a game changer for me now let's go ahead and get to the end of the month I don't know. I'm not sure about the way that this is kind of like broken down. Uh, so here we are at the end of the month and we're starting a new week, right? But it happens to be only just the last few days of the month here. So this is July. So we've got Monday and Tuesday. And then uh, we have a notes page here. So the week is broken up. Um, and then we go into August and I'm going to kind of jump ahead past the monthly and then we go into Wednesday. So I don't know, for me, that seems a little strange, uh, the way that that was like broken up. I, I think it's probably just the way things kind of like end up when they are designing these, because here we are at the end of August and we have the end of August ending on Saturday and then we have like Sunday over here. I don't know. I think I would have prefer being able to like keep the week together. Like I don't mind if days overlap a little, but I'd rather have like the week kind of end out in one month and then a new week start fresh in the next month. But I do have to say because of the way that they designed this, with these notes pages where they are located. If you are somebody like me that uncoils and moves things around, then that is completely doable with this new design. So I'm pretty excited. Like I'm really, really excited about this. If you don't like to uncoil your planner, which is completely understandable, then you know this would just be something that you would have to um, be okay with, I guess. So I just wanted to point that out to you because we're planners and I look at these things and I know that you do as well. All right, let's go back and let's look at the monthly tabs. Courage permits you space to explore. Let your thoughts give hope and guidance. You have so much to offer as the person you are right now. Personal growth lies within the unknown. And happiness is not by chance, but by choice. Oh, that's so true. Love, love, love those quotes. Okay, we're going to go to the end here. So the end is also the end of the year for 2024. And at the back end, there is a notes page. Then we have heritage and awareness observances down here. And we've got our back page. 
and we have our stickers. Now there are four pages of stickers in the back here. It's a nice little assortment. Uh, this page has a detailing of silver foil. This one has gold foil detailing. This one has a rose gold and this one has a silver. So we've got four pages there. Then we have our pocket, which is double sided. I like that. And then our back inside cover. Love it. All right, now we also have the same thing in the other six months. I'll just go ahead and flip through the months here. So now we're into um, the next six months. So of course we have our six boxes and then we have 2025 here starting and then 2026. Oh my gosh, I can't even think of 2026, right? Um, let alone 2025, but that's how this one is set up. And then we've got our tabs, January, don't wish for it, work for it, purpose fuels, passion, discover who you are beyond who you've been, what you imagine you create, find acceptance within yourself. If you get tired, learn to reset, not to quit. Great quotes. And in the back, we have the same thing. We have the four sticker pages, the pocket, and oh, we've got our perpetual calendar in here. And calendar and contacts, which those are great to have. Oh my gosh. So there it is, the new daily duo. I am so excited about this new design. I, I think that they just, I mean, listen to everything. That's amazing. I love it. They were able to do it for us and I'm super excited about it. All right, let's go ahead and dive into these accessories that we have here. Um, there are sticker sheets that we saw at the back of the planner that you can purchase separately. So they are the same exact sticker sheets that we saw there, um, but you can buy these packs uh, if you want more of them, or if you want to, of course, pick up like the Evolve or the Bold Blooms um, packs, then you can get those separate. All right, the next thing we have here is the designer sticker book. I like this design. We've got this like flap over here. It says your dreams are achievable. It opens up like that. Got different shaded boxes in here, different icons. There is an assortment of different foils as well throughout this sticker book. And the one page I thought was really interesting was this one right here where it is the transparent stickers. I like to use these to color code different things that are going on for the year. Now, I know that these used to be sold separately, but now they're in this sticker book, which is really cool. I like that idea. And they do have little asterisks on there. So I'm hoping that this actually works the same way. I like to use tweezers for these because this is really tiny. All right, I'm going to grab one of these. I'm going to grab one of the darker colors. And you can see that it has the little asterisk on there. So, But it is still clear, like transparent. Yeah, it definitely still works. You just have the little asterisk on there. I love that this page is in here. All right, let's keep looking at the rest of the book here, all different kinds of stickers in here. There's habit trackers and little icons and heading stickers in here, the long strip stickers, and of course, a lot of boxes. All right, we have the mini snap in bookmarks, the little asterisk on a neutral color. Um, there is some gold foil elements. A silver foil elements and then a rose gold. Um, we've got different colors on the back side here. Just go ahead and pop that in there and you've got your page finder or of course you could flip it around if you wanted to as well and use it as a bottom page finder just like that. All right, and then there is a dashboard. So this is a universal snap-in dashboard. Um, it does have priorities on this side and a to-do on that side. And then it has Monday through Sunday. I like that it has the rose gold foil on there. That's really pretty. Um, and that can be popped in anywhere in your planner. 
a dashboard there where you can write things in by using a dry erase or wet erase marker or you could put your sticky notes on here. I think that that is a great way to go ahead and use these dashboards as well. So I also want to show you the sticky notes here. And this is really nice the way that this is designed because it does have the page finder here. So you can go ahead and just snap that in, it snaps in nice and easily. It's the same material as the ruler. So these sticky notes are great to use on the dashboard as well. And that's sort of how I like to use these dashboards. I think that that works great. Like that way for the day in your sidebar. And this is a great way to do like pre-planning for the month. You can use those in there. You need to block out some time that works that way. All right, so we also have some washi tape, which I love. Look at this wide washi tape. Isn't that cool? I really like that. This is like the wisteria color. And then we have this blue. And then there's this peachy one with this gold foil stripe down the middle of it and then the grid. And then there are also new dual tip highlighters and they listen to us because the colors are printed on here. So now these are dual tip. Dual tip is going to have the highlighted side on this side here or the chisel side. And then on the other side, is like the tip side, but it's not super thin. It's not a thin tip. It's definitely a marker. I do have to say one thing. Thank you, first of all, Erin Condor for listening, that we want the colors listed on the pens when we use them, the markers. However, that is so teeny. Like that is really teeny tiny. And that's fine if you've got great vision, but if you don't, that is really difficult to see. So. Thank you, thank you so much for printing the colors onto the markers. They just need to be a little bit bigger. Okay, so that is um, one thing about these. Love, love, love. I did already swatch these out. Um, so we have Harbor. Love the colors. The light gray here. Then we have the powder blue, spruce, sand, and rose pink. I love these colors. They are so pretty. And you could see that I have the chisel side here. And then of course, I wrote out the color here. I did write the color here in black as well, because I wanted to make sure that you were able to see it nice and clearly. And then I have the washi swatched out. I love this wide washi. That is so pretty. You can do so many different things with that. I love that. All right, so that is everything that I received in the canvas collection. And now I wanna share with you the items that I was sent to from the Evolve collection. Look at how beautiful that is. Those colors are so vibrant. I love them. All right, this is a petite uh, notebook here. This is a, the productivity notebook. So the color on the inside is this really a pretty soft green. I'm actually gonna open it up so that way we're looking at both sides. Uh, first off, we have a shaded heading up there. And then on the left side is line notes section and there is a section down here for lists, including some bullet points. So two columns of those. And then on this side, we again have another heading up here. We have a whole lined notes section here, an area to the side here with a long checklist and then a shaded box. So I really like this design. And then each page has a different color on here. And it's just really, really pretty. So we've got our Erin Condren colors in here. And then I think it'll start to repeat here. Yep, very, very pretty. So these fit beautifully inside the petite folios. And I love this size. It's great for on the go. 
Uh, this one is the monthly planner that they sent in the petite size. And this is really pretty. It's got more of like that peachy color, but the swirls in here, love that. And this has got a really pretty foil on here, monthly planner from July of 2024 to December of 2025. So this is an 18 month planner here. It's monthly. The inside peach color is really pretty. It says right on here, petite planner, monthly planner. This book belongs to, and then we open it up and this is so pretty. I love those colors. They're so vibrant. Etta V is so beautiful. I love using the Etta V collection for um, my planners or my notebooks where I'm not using stickers. Like colorful, it just makes me really happy. All right, so we've got July through December and then there is a blank section down here for you to use however you choose. And then here we are in July and you can see that sweep in there. Then we have our sidebar here and then we just go into each month. So I'm going to flip through this so that way you can kind of see the colors for each month. And then each of the months uh, do uh, color coordinate with the design in here. I like that. I like using this uh, size to put in my handbag. It's just such a nice size for that. It's really convenient. So that's the 18 month and then the remainder here are all notes pages. And then we have the Erin Condren emblem up in the corner, but on the back side there is nothing. So really like that. And then here we are the back where we have a 2026. Oh my goodness, can't even think of that year. All right, and then here's the back inside cover and then there is a sticker sheet in here with a little folder. Okay, the next thing I have here is this beautiful planty pack. I love these. Look at how pretty this is. It feels so nice. And these colors, oh, wow. Like, wow, they're so beautiful. There's just something about seeing all of this in person too. Like when you see things being filmed or in photography, it, you just don't get the quite the same pop. It's so pretty. It's got this gold hardware. I'm loving that pink around there, or purple color. Um, it does have a front pocket here. It's like nice and soft on the inside. And then we're gonna open it up and take a look and look at that beautiful pink in there. Isn't that pretty? Pockets in here are a very thin liner. And then of course, um, we have the little elasticized band on the back here, which actually this fits perfectly over the uh, petite planners. I love this because it's just like a really cute little like pack that you have there. Also keeps your uh, planner closed. So that is really pretty. And then when you use these on your regular like seven by nine planners, that obviously is much thicker. So you just clip it on to the front cover. Okay, and then you flip it open and you, it's, you're all attached there. And these fit a lot in here. I really like how spacious they are. The pen that goes with the Evolve. Um, they did change these pens out last year. This is a gel pen. Look at how pretty this box is. I think this makes just such a pretty gift. I really like that. And let's take this out and you can see just how pretty this is. And this is a vegan leather wrap around here. So it's got like a nice feel to it. It does have gold hardware. And like I said, it is a gel pen. So pretty. I have a few more accessories to share with you. And then I also want to share with you the gift with purchase. Oh my gosh, you are going to be so excited about it. These are metallic markers. I love these. They come in like this nice little tray that pulls out. Look at how nicely they put the color of the pen on here. I love that. Yes, you can see that nice and clear. And these have a nice point to them. I did already swatch these out as well. So let me share that with you. All right, so here's the swatch out and look at how pretty they are. Copper, 
the gold, the charcoal, the silver, wisteria, peony, olive, and cerulean. I love it. It has like this little like metallic to it. You can kind of see it when you like turn it a little bit. It's they're really, really pretty colors. All right. So last year they brought us snap in pockets for our planners. And this year they have improved those pockets for us by creating them with the tabs. So I'm going to go ahead and show you there's three of them here and they are colored. The ones that we got last year were just clear. So now we have them with tabs at the top and they also have the pockets um, still here in the front. And then there's also another one in the back of the divider. And it's that really nice plastic that I like. It pops in nice and easily. Um, so we've got this peach color, we've got this peacock color here. And then this like, uh, I guess it would be like the wisteria color. So I really like these and we're going to look at these a little bit more in just a second. Um, and then there's also a notepad pocket dashboard. This is really cool. So look at how pretty that notepad is. I love that. So we've got nice quantity here with all of the different colors. It is on this dashboard and it it comes out so you could pull that out and you can have just the notepad by itself on the table and you can use this in your planner so it has the pocket on the front and then it also has another pocket in the back here so now let me show you how these would work in the planner all right now this is really thick and this is something that would probably be better off like on the front of the planner because that's going to add a lot of thickness in here, but you could definitely like pop that in wherever you needed to, like if you needed to have that somewhere in your planner for convenience. But again, this kind of pops up then. So I'm not so sure about this particular design. Um, I like the concept of it. You could always thin it out. You don't have to have like the full pad in there. That's another way to do that. Um, let me take this off. Or you could just put it on the top of your planner. Then that way you have an extra notepad there, which is really, I feel like, the way that it should be used. So that way you have that there as an extra note section and then you would go into your planner from there. That makes more sense. And then let's go ahead and take a look at these dividers here, which that's gonna be really nice because I like the tabs on there. Yeah, and then you have the tab sticking out. So I like that because I like to have top tabs in my planner. It makes it so much easier to find different sections as you need to. All right, the last item that I have to share with you is a new vegan leather folio. Here it is. It's got a clear front cover, and then it is, of course, vegan leather. It's trimmed around. It has a rounded edge to it. It does have a nice little flap closure here. It does have the two snaps available, depending on how big your planner is. A pen loop here, which is an elasticized pen loop. It has a little pocket right here, and then there's a flap, and then there's this slide in pocket, which your planner will slide into. Now it will fit your 12 month planner and add ons, as well as an 18 month life planner without add ons. And a notebook will fit in here, but then it will be obviously a lot looser because the notebooks are on a smaller coil. So here is the one half of my planner. And you can see it's got the different snaps here, depending. You could bring it in a little bit tighter if you need to, um, depending on what you have in here. So I think that this is really cool. It's like just protects your planner, but it also allows us to see the beautiful covers that we choose for our planner. So I really like that. Um, this is gonna come in three colors, 
This one is the Peacock, and then there is also a Fuchsia and a Wisteria available. Let's go ahead and look back here, and this notepad will actually, you could slide it out of the dashboard, and it will fit in here nicely. So this is an option if you decide to get the cover and you want to have like this notepad in here. You could fit that in there nice and comfortable, or you could take any of your extra sticker sheets and you could put those in the back. And those will fit in there. There's the sticker book that would fit in there. This is really nice and soft. I like the way that that feels. You could put your perpetual calendar in the back here. So there's different things that will definitely fit in here. Um, with the pen loops, um, this one would probably work okay. Something that has like this little clip. You could slide that in there. And then let's go ahead and close it up. Now this one I would put just on the first snap because I think that that fits most comfortably. Yeah, and you've got everything all together. It does have the Erin Condren emblem on the back there. I like that. 18 month planner with a larger coil will fit in here, but you're not going to be able to fit a lot of things like in the back, like a lot of like add on stuff like this accessories. Let's go ahead and talk about this gift with purchase. Oh my gosh, this is for the first time ever. It is only available during the first few days of the launch and it is a life planner sampler set look at this. I love this idea. This is amazing. You get a sample of each of the five life planner layouts, all three designs, and you can start planning in it as soon as you get your box. It is dated. It is going to go ahead and help you get through until you can start using your planner, which starts in July. It says here, use each layout for one week and see how it feels with your schedule and personal style. April 29th through May 5th, and that is going to be an Evolve Vertical. So we're going to look in here and look at the uh, sample that we get of the monthly dashboard page with the evolved design in it and then here is the vertical so we do have some color throughout it because evolve is a colorful design uh, we've got the sidebar here you've got your month overview calendar in the corner and then of course you have your three boxes with your little uh, lined boxes at the bottom here so pretty. Okay, let's go ahead and move on. And this one is Bold Blooms. And this is the horizontal layout. And you can see the different style of font that's in here. And then, of course, the design of it. So you have a lined section for each day and then a blank section. And then you do have a extra box down here with a little calendar and now we're gonna turn the page here and this is an hourly in the canvas design. This is so nice. Actually, the last two layouts, I've never even tried them. So I am excited to go ahead and give these a try. There are a couple of habit trackers down here. And then of course we have um, a little blank section at the top to put like your highlight for your day. Starts at 6 a.m. to 7 p.m. And then you have a little section here at the bottom. All right, and we get to try out the Evolve, the compact vertical. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to give this a try. I really like this design, but it was only available last year in the A5. So many people loved it. So they, of course, brought it to us in the seven by nine size. And then here we are into our next week, and this is the Evolve Daily. So of course we took a close look at the daily planner so we know how that layout is designed. And of course we're seeing the colors in here because Evolve has got the colors. So I like that. 
All right, now we are over here looking at a bold blooms design in a vertical. And we've got canvas in a horizontal layout. And we've got evolve in a hourly vertical layout. And then we have another compact vertical layout and this is in the bold blooms design. And that brings us through the end of June right into our planners that start July 1st. This is such an amazing gift with purchase. I, I was like shocked. I couldn't believe it. So definitely want to pick up your life planners that first week of the launch. EC Insider launch is April 15th and the general launch is April 16th. I am an affiliate of Erin Condren. I greatly appreciate when you use my affiliate link. It is down below in the description. Thank you so much to those of you that have already used it. I know many of you have. Greatly appreciate you for that. And by using my link, I was able to be chosen to go ahead and share all of these items with you, which of course allows you to do your shopping early, ask me any questions that you like, and I will be happy to answer them to the best of my ability. And if I don't have the answer, I will find it out for you. And start making your wish list because I know that there's something that you're probably going to want to pick up. During this time, everything comes out at regular price, but please take a look at the free shipping limits. That way, if you are making a large purchase, you can go ahead and take advantage of that. If you are completely new to Erin Condren and you've never ordered anything before, I do have a code down below that you can use, so make sure that you use that. Be sure to sign up for the EC Insider program. That way you can start earning your reward points with this purchase. If you like this video, please be sure to give me a thumbs up. Please be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Of course, I will be continuing to share how I use these items along with whatever purchase I make during this launch. Comment down below and let me know your thoughts on the changes that they have made for us and what is your favorite design that you're looking at getting for this year's Life Planner. And if you watch this video all the way through till the end, be sure to leave me an asterisk emoji. Thank you so much and I will see you in the next one. Bye.